Hello and welcome to today's video. Today we are here and we are playing NASCAR Heat 5. So, the premise of this video is, as we get close to the new NASCAR game, which is called, um, something. What's it called? NASCAR 21, uh... What is it? Ignition. Yes. As we get close to that game coming out, I want to make sure I'm in the spot to have won at every single track in this game. Now, that's of course one of the trophies in NASCAR Heat 5. Uh, looking at it, I don't know about dirt track because there's that's its own category, but I want to win every single one as a truck, cup, and Xfinity track. So that's 31 options. So looking at this, short and sweet, and best of the rest, I still have Super Speedway. I have won at both Talladega and Daytona, and I've won at all the road courses in the game. So Pocono and Richmond are the only two tracks I have not won at. I've tried five Pocono races and have not won it. Now, I tend to race the truck series uh, just because those races are so much shorter that I don't necessarily care if, oh no, I lost the race. Like, I can just, you know, come in here and restart it. Where a cup race is a very, very large commitment to doing Xfinity, I don't care about doing. So. Trucks really make sense for me to come in here and try and get that win. Now, I don't think that there are trucks or Xfinity in the uh, next game, which is a bit disappointing. Because I actually tend to race the trucks more than Cup or Xfinity. Because again, the races are shorter, they're a little more enjoyable to do. Now, I always struggle in turn two here. That's the main issue for me is turn two. Careful, still there. Okay. Now I'm going to get to the front of this field really easy. Outside by itself. Right here, we're just going to pit. All right, we're being pit uh, everybody will pit at the end the of flag. stage one here. Now, real NASCAR rules say you cannot pit with two laps to go in a stage. The difference is NASCAR Heat's a way of implementing that. In NASCAR, if you pit, when pit road is closed, I believe it's just a lap penalty. That's either a drive through or on a restart, you go back to the field or something along those lines. The way NASCAR Heat handles penalties is a longer pit stop. If I'm on lap two now, because I've crossed the line, I can just take that penalty, the field flies by, but I don't get lapped because they cross the line for the stage and it's over. So we're going to come out of the pits and just slowly ride along here because as you can see, Johnny Sauter won the stage and whoever was in 10th crossed the line that was coming out of the pits. I didn't go a lap down and now I cannot pit and I take the lead. So it's kind of an easy way to finesse your way to the front in NASCAR Heat uh, because they don't actually use the right, same the rules that uh, you know, actual NASCAR officiating uses when it comes to somebody pitting when pit road's closed, which pit road does close with two laps to go on a stage. Basically, they do that to avoid what I just did. They don't want that happening in real life, which totally makes sense. You don't want somebody who's back in, you know, 23rd to be like, all right, we'll pay here with one to go in the stage. We'll be in the front when the stage winner has to then pit. So they're trying to exactly avoid what I did. But this game doesn't have a way to avoid it. So you can kind of finesse the system, which I love to absolutely do in these races. Um... I'll always take that and use that as a way to get to the front in some of these tracks that 
you know, you know when it's going to happen. Because in this, I've done it so much because I've tried to win this track so many times that I know exactly what's going to happen. I knew that that pit stop was happening at the end of the first stage. They do it every single time. How's our tires looking? They're not terrible, but I just know that I cannot win this race this way. I just, it's an absolute struggle. Pocono's a track for me that I just cannot do good on. Turn two is one that I just don't understand. Uh, that's honestly my best drive through turn two that I've had, like, ever. Here we go, we're going to come off of this turn, finish stage uh, two here in third place, which is not terrible. Had to send a real quick message. Mom's extra wants to know what I need. Watermelon Red Bull, please. <laughs> and uh, summer edition, of course. Don't forget. Halo Deans are the one uh, exception for drivers or anybody that's sponsored by Monster. That's okay. <laughs> Honestly, I don't. I don't root for anybody with Monster. So Halo Deans the one one exception. Push him into the wall. Slow him down. I'll take that push into the corner, Sheldon Creed. Thank you. Austin Hill's going to get used the fuck up in that corner. Sheldon Creed. Don't let him by. Don't let him pass. All right. Got a headline out on your bumper. That's fine. Now we're going to use this draft down the straight. We stayed in in the top five. Not a problem here. Use this draft. Pull ourselves all the way down to this corner. Chastain right there. Minor contact with him. Drove in there with way too much force. Take out Ben Rhodes there to bring back uh, Shelter Creed and Austin Hill. They definitely got away from us there. A little tiny bit. All we gotta do is make it one lap and hope it's caution. We can be in a solid spot heading down to that last corner. Uh, on the last lap. Push Creed out there in front a little bit. Then into this corner that we go, and we go here. All clear. Ooh, big slide, big slide, big slide. Not what I wanted, what not what I wanted. God damn it. All right, I'm in 12th now. Not a problem, not a problem. Alright, everybody's running out of gas Side. soon too. This is getting wild now. Left 
Destroy Agus into that corner. Holy shit. As you can see, the back of my truck is pretty damaged. Drive safe. Be smart. He just came into the side of us. Eckes is somehow ahead. I took tires and got fucked. God damn it. That's fine though, that's fine. Okay, now, that changes our race strategy. We have better tires than everybody else at this point, so. Get full send into this corner. Careful, still there. Car outside. All right, clear outside. Left side. Up into 20th, or 22nd. All right, we might have set off a minor crash there, but here's the thing: we're gonna get this win. I'm confident. Be ready. Got one up top. All right, I need two more to left. Nobody out back. Thank God, we're dropping bad. We're dropping real bad. We're dropping terrible now. All right. Clear outside. We'll pit. We'll get basically a brand new truck. Sheldon Creed will be back here. With All us. right. Ooh. Be smart out there. Going green. Be ready. Ready. Inside. Yeah, I can slow him down. Slow him down. I need two more left, but keep going. Clear <laughs> <up>. <laughs> what a move. We can just charge through this field and slice our way through everybody in our corner. Back into the top 20 we go. Car there on the outside. All the way up. Get up. Get up. Clear high. Ooh. Yes. I knew eventually we could finesse our way back here. Carter has the green flag in his hand. Be ready. Couple more turns, two more, two to go. Still there, clear right. Alright, here we go. Going for our first Pocono win. In what was intended to be an eight lap race, has now gone 33. We've slowly worked to finesse our way into this spot. Block Sheldon Creed there. And Brett Moffitt. Block them both. Alright, run along the bottom here. Down this main straight, nobody's gonna catch us or be able to pass us here. This is it, last lap. We have to commit to getting this win. 
all in here. This is it. Run the bottom. Beautiful. Beautiful run along the bottom there. Brett Moffat and Sheldon Creed both still coming at us. Got one up top. Left side. Still there. Damn it. I'm just so... F I fucking hate this track. Fucking hate this track. 